We have our eco tank here. This is our 16600. This is our baby. This thing prints amazingly. They have many different printers out there to get. This Epson is really a good brand to convert. This is, like I said, the 16600. This prints up to a 13 by 19 print. What I'll be doing in this video is actually refilling our ink into our um, machine here. Um, let me take this off so maybe y'all can see a little bit. But if you can see here, our ink is a little low. Our yellow is a little low. Um, this is our yellow, our magenta, our cyan, and then our black. And I'm just going to fill all these up just so that I can show y'all in a video how to actually fill the ink cartridges. So when you do an initial fill, um, before I even cut my printer on, I do this. So I would take our HOV Plus Sub Sublimation Ink or your sublimation ink of choice. It doesn't have to be ours. But if you're using an eco tank, you do need an eco tank uh, bottle. They kind of, if you open them up, they kind of look like this. This one has been used before. Um, and the yellow, magenta, and cyan look the same. They have those those tops. And so what I would do is I would pull this down. It's a very easy to release. Before, like I said, I do this when I, when I first got my printer. I filled my ink up before I even plugged it in. So I took all of the blue stickers off of it, all of everything off of it. And then I fill my ink up. And the refill process is exactly like the initial fill. So the first thing that I'm going to fill is my black. That's going to be on our far left. So all I would do is, if y'all can see it, I'll, I'll just put my finger here and i just flip that back. I'll take this black, remove the cap. This is very simple to do, guys. And I would just flip this over and fill. And if you can listen, you can hear the ding, ding, ding. <laughs> But once that's filled up, I'll remove this and I'll go on to my next color, which is cyan. And it's almost filled. It takes just a couple minutes to fill each color. And that one's filled. I would make sure we get all of it in there. The black does not, it does not take all of the black on the initial fill. I just want to let y'all know that. You will have some black left over. Replace the cap. I save these. So the reason that I save my EcoTank bottles is because I'm frugal. <laughs> they say I'm cheap. I say, no, I'm not cheap. I'm frugal. I can't be cheap. I like too much expensive stuff to be cheap. But I'm frugal. So I don't throw money in the trash. Without What I mean by that is these EcoTank bottles are like a gym. If y'all want, y'all can keep buying the eco tank system from me over and over again. I'm good with that. If you don't want mess, that's the best way if you don't want to get dirty. But if you don't mind getting a little dirty, I would save this eco tank bottle and I would purchase these 500 milliliter bottles and um, I would fill, refill them into here to put them in my eco tank. Does that make sense? So once this is empty, I would save this buy bigger bottles that are that are cheaper to buy per you know per milliliter of um a fluid and then i will refill it into here and i will refill this with a syringe um i i what i do is i'll put a syringe down in there and i will refill these bottles and so i'm gonna move on to my next color which is cyan unscrew that Close the black back up, flip the cyan over. Y'all, this is not, this is very, very, very simple to do. Turn it over. Boop, 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 boop. Boom. Okay, I'm, I'm silly. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, yeah, I would just, I'm just filling this up to the top. Um, Some people say don't overfill your cartridge all the way up to the top. That's the I always do. I always do. Um, I pull this out and it's going to stop on its own. It's pretty clean. Um, and I just put the top on and move right along to my next color. Close that up. Next color, magenta. Boom. 
and magenta was pretty low. I don't know if y'all can see. Y'all see it filling up? Mm-hmm. And once that's finished, I will lift that out, put the cap back on, and move right along to my next color. My last color is yellow. I'll close that one back up, and I'll do yellow. And if y'all want to see the yellow filling, uh -uh. and once that's done, I will put that cap back on. And that's pretty much it, y'all. I'll close that back up, make sure that all of them are secure. I will close our eco tank system back. And that is it. That is how you refill or initially fill an Epson 16600. Um, the smaller Epson Eco Tanks, you definitely refill those exactly the same. Thanks, like, comment, subscribe. Um, you can buy our ink at www.houseofvinylcrafts.com. Thank you guys very much for tuning in. You see you guys later. Bye.